Good evening, fish and friends. Welcome to another episode. As you can see, the sun is in my eyes. It is setting quickly, so I got another quick session after work. Hopefully, we can make something happen tonight. I got chatterbait, spinnerbait, buzzbait. Heck, I might even throw a jig around tonight. Who knows? Hopefully, there's a fun adventure that awaits tonight. So, let's stop yapping, start fishing. All right, fish and friends, just got to the lake here, and this is why I always say be prepared. You never know what it's going to be like when you get there. Last time I was here, the water was way, way up super dirty i get here now and i can see down to the bottom here i saw a bass when i first walked up a ton of bluegill up here this is crazy two bass falling right now two bass right behind it got him oh my gosh got that one two of them stocking it black and blue jig just dragging it slow how about that man well i probably scared that other one off there we go first bass on the night not a big dude little pounder holy smokes that was awesome watching those two stock that gotta give them a little drop nuts that is nuts all right found some more wood i see a bass right over here off the edge of this dang they are very spooky Here's one, here's one. Looking at it right now, looking at it right now. Two of them, three of them. Oh, come on, fish, eat this. Oh, son of a, son of a gun. Threw it in there and that fish grabbed it and I missed it. All right, I made a small change. I just tied on just a regular, you know, regular roll Senko. I've only got one in my bag. I cleaned my bag out, packed light tonight. I packed for real dirty, you know, muddy water. Didn't bring anything extra. Look at that. Oh, first cast, something grabbed it. Oh. Got a little guy. All right, that one switch. Made that one switch to something a little bit more finesse and caught one. That's a little one, but still. Making that change. Oh, and he threw my only stick bait. What are you doing, fish? I have to go scrounging for that. All right, made a little change. Got a little guy. Of course, I catch the littlest one in the pack. Let him go here, try not to spook everything else. Okay, they're hitting it when it's moving, when it goes down. They're not really destroying it. I'm gonna try throwing this jackhammer. Maybe this will save the day. Maybe they want something moving. There we go. One on the jackhammer. Whoa! He's hyped up. All right, there we go. Not a big guy. That's the jackhammer getting us one. Okay, okay. Maybe we're getting somewhere here. Stop fish. All right, there we go. What a crazy spot. There's bluegill all over this wood. But these bass are just not crazy. I was throwing the jig at them here earlier. Nothing. Let's see. He's off. All right, well, I'm gonna keep throwing this, this jackhammer. Maybe we can call in a big one. Golly, there were so many bass over here. Oh, that's definitely not what we want. Son of a gun. And just like that, the jackhammer is gone. Well, let's see if anything over here will eat the buzz bait. There we go. Oh. There we go. Oh, son of a... There's another one. Oh, my night of lost baits and blown opportunities well i found the stick bait son of a biscuit get a trailer hook on here gosh darn it lost the jackhammer got to use that for a whole day and of course it was a it was a chatter bait so i lost it <sighs> buzz baits i try to always run a trailer on those when i can just because you get so many short strikes like that 
Oh my gosh, that was what, three, four misses right there on the buzzmate? Now I can't even get it. Oh my gosh. There's fish blowing up all over here. Oh, there we go. Put the trailer on and got one. First bite that time. Nice. All right, there we go. Buzz bait. Get me some bites. Whoa. And there he goes. Not a big fish, but that was a fish. Man, tonight has been something else. Let's see, can we get any more on the old buzz bait? Buzz bait with the Reaction Innovations little dipper on the back. Let's see if we can catch some more of these hungry fish. Come on, a few more buzz bait fish. Let's go. Let's finish the night out strong here. Lost the jackhammer. Let's not make that sacrifice for nothing. Oh, there's a big one right there. And hit the tree behind me, about broke my rod. Come on, sun going down. Let's get some more of these buzzbait bites. What the heck, fish? Come on. There we go. Another one. I'll stay out of that. Oh, what am I stuck in? Somebody else's line. Oh my gosh, sorry, fish. All right, there's another one on the buzz bait. Let's go. A night of frustration and missed fish and oh, finally we found something they'll eat. That's it, right there. Right there, that little buzz bait. Get this guy back. A little bit better than the others. All right, see you, dude. All right, let's keep going. We got a few fish fired up over here. Cut a few on the old buzz bait. The old SLXDC is working a little bit better now. I had to read the instruction manual. Kind of feel like a gomer, but first bait caster I've actually had to read the instruction manual on. Had to tighten that spool tension up a little bit more than I normally do. You know, to remove, oh, there it is, another one. Yes. Get out of there, bass. That's a little bit better one. There we go, a little bit better one. Yes. How flipping fun is this? Targeting this wood pile, that's another bass. Stop fish. Uh, whoa, rod almost in the water. There we go, best one of the night. That dude's gotta be close to two pounds. Oh yeah, look at how long he is. He's a two pounder. Best one of the night, wow. All right, I'm gonna get back in. It appears I may have fired up a few fish here, which is flipping awesome. They're just all on this little Wow, I stepped on that rod. How flipping awesome is that? I freaking stepped on that rod on that. I don't, I don't even know what to say. Brand new rod, I've only used it a few times. It has been that night. I thought I just stepped on it walking backwards there and I did. Oh my gosh, I can't believe that. Brand new flipping Arc Lancer Pro. <sighs> what am I doing? What am I doing with my life tonight? All right, I had to call a quick audible. Put the buzzbait on that rod that I just had the jackhammer on and broke off. This is that little Dobbins Fury 733. This will be perfect for this, but oh my gosh, I'm honestly about ready to, I don't even know. I don't even know what I'm gonna do. $100 rod, just stepped on it and broke it. Guess we'll see what their uh, warranty's like, huh? Gosh, these fish are feeding. I've been fiddling around, trying to find baits. Had to switch my rod there. I don't, oh gosh. I don't even know what to say tonight, to be honest. Oh, there we go. There we go. Oh my gosh, they are just stacked on this wood. Yes. Oh, what a fun night. What a flipping fun night. This is what bass fishing early fall. Oh man, these fish are starting to turn on and it feels good, I ain't gonna lie. Gotta get the pliers for that dude. All right, another one. A little over a pound, but he was aggressive. All right, dude, go. Yes. I mean, this has just been jackpot, absolute jackpot. Ton of fish here earlier. Didn't want to eat the jig when I was throwing at him. A little spooky. Maybe if I'd have had, I don't know, stick bait they ate, but I lost that one. All right, let's see. Can we drag a few more out of this with the buzz bait? Oh. More fish down there getting after it. Oh, oh, oh. 
Oh, they're just all around this wood. Oh, what a crazy night. Oh, I can't believe I broke my flipping rod though. What an idiot, there's another one. Another fish. Oh my gosh, these fish are feeding and charged up. It's another decent fish. Oh, almost slipped on the mud. What a crazy night. He stole my, I better have more of those soft plastics. I just cleaned out my bag. Oh dear gosh, help me, I hope I have more. There we go, another dude over pound. Gosh, they've all been aggressive too, I don't care. Look at that. Okay, so here's the only bad part about running a trailer is when this happens. Now I gotta pull this plastic thing off, slip my new plastic on. Now if this is a regular buzz bait, it wouldn't be an issue, but because I got a soft plastic on here, the way tonight's going, I can see me shoving this in my hand. That wouldn't be good. Oh, there we go, take this off. God, I wanna hurry, these fish are feeding. I don't want them to stop. Oh, buzz bait, yeah, we'd like to eat a buzz bait. This isn't fun, I don't, I don't know what to tell you. All right, let's hope that holds. Question is, do I move? Do I move from here to try and find bigger fish? You know what they say, don't leave fish to find fish, right? Question is, is there any more here? Oh, oh my gosh. Oh, that one hit it in the second one, come out of the water for it. Oh my goodness. Unbelievable night of fishing. Oh no, that's a good fish, get out of there. Dang it. Not gonna lie, a little bit frustrated. I'm sorry, fishing friends. I know I try to say, don't get frustrated, keep going. I'm doing everything right. I've got, I mean, the rods got bent. That one just got stuck on that log. There was nothing I can do. I gave it slack to try and get it over that log. That was a decent fish. There's one. Stay out of that stuff. Trying to dog me into it. That's a little bit better one. There we go. Can't see my dang line. That's a two pounder. All right. All right, there we go. Another good little two pounder. A couple two pounders on the night. Nothing over that yet. All right, get out of here, fish. Oh man, so much fun. All right, I'm gonna make a quick, quick change. I think I'm gonna move spots. I'm gonna have to run basically. There's nothing else hitting here though. Just as I said that, really. Might be the best one of the night. That is the best one of the night. Pull and drag on me, that's a good fish. Oh my God, just as I said I was gonna move. What? Just as I said I was gonna move, stop fish, please. I can't see that hook. Oh yeah, you're a good fish, look at that. Just as I said I was gonna move. Oh my gosh. What an unreal night of fishing, look at that. That dude is thick and chunky. Let's get a weight just to see. I bet he's uh, three and a half maybe. Let's see. All right, there we go. Clipped in, pounds and ounces, we're at. Oh, see, and I was even short on that one. That's almost a four pounder, three pounds, 13, 13 ounces. All right, let's get this big girl back. Four pounder, that might be the last one of the night, but man, what a way to end it. Big old four pound chunk. All right, fishing friends, just got home off the water. I got good news and I got bad news. The good news is that happened to be the deal for me tonight. That's a War Eagle buzz bait instead of the, you know, the frog that they normally have on there. Put a Reaction Innovation Skinny Dipper on there. That's in the Houdini color. Did work tonight. Fishing that on the Inception SZ Reel. I'm liking that quite a bit right now. That's from 13 Fishing and then my Dobbins Fury 733. That was the good news. The bad news is that, you know, Arc Lancer Pro Rod that I've been using and liking, like that rod a lot, but uh, yeah, now it's a two-piece. So I guess I'm gonna see what the customer service is like. Hopefully I can get that uh, replaced, but that sucked. Stepped on it, broke it, snapped it right in half as soon as I just barely cast it. I heard it, I knew, I'm gonna see in the video, I think I just said, did I step on my rod? My subscribe fishing friend shout out for tonight is from my man, Chris McVeigh. Thank you so much for watching my videos, brother. You've supported me from the beginning and I truly do appreciate that. So that's all I have for tonight. Thank you all for watching and until next time.